Hi, Michael Brown here, and I want to introduce a cool new plugin called WP Click Me. And the concept behind WP Click Me is that you can get more clicks on your money links. Now, this is extremely important if you have a, a blog and you want people to obviously click on things that are going to make you more money. And that, whether you're putting on affiliate products, whether you're putting on your own products, whether you want people to who click through to your advertisers, okay, if you have advertisers that are paying you money to advertise, obviously the more clicks you get them, the happier they're going to be. This bar does that for you. It lets you get more attention to your money links and make more money. Okay, your typical blog looks like this, okay? There's nothing really um, standing out here, uh, you know, some images and things like that. Now, what we're going to do, I'm going to show you what WP Click Me actually does to make your blog uh, show off your money links a little better here. Okay, we're going to go to a site here, and here's one demo of what one of the top bars looks like. Okay, it just fits right in the top, stands out, contrasts with the site, and gets people's attention. So they'll click on it and do what you want them to do, which is usually buy something, okay, or get into your opt-in list or, or whatever you want to do. They can do it right from here. Okay, and I just want to show you what this looks like when you first come to the site. If you first come here, it loads and then the bar will drop down into place right here and get people's attention boom right there in their face it bounces a few times it really grabs the visitors attention okay that's what this bar does now it also has a couple other cool functionalities I want to show you here uh, it has a bottom the option to have a bottom bar and I'm gonna scroll down to make sure you can see this because I don't know on my recording if you can Okay, it fits right down at the bottom of the page. Okay, right there. And this bounces into place as well. So if this were to bounce into place, boom, right there, gets their attention. And we also have a corner bar option. And hopefully I can get this whole thing in here. If not, I'll have a demo page set up that you guys can go and check out. But you can see over in the corner of the screen, the little corner bar fits into place too. It fits unintrusively there so it can grab your visitors attention without fully annoying them like some pop-ups do um, and other things that make people have to click to get out of it. Um, those things can annoy people and they won't want to come back. These fit unintrusively on the site to grab your visitors attention. Okay, Now I want to quickly show you how to install this because it's very very simple to do. We're just going to go over here to another site and I'm going to go into the dashboard. And all you need to do to install this is go into plugins, click install plug, or I'm sorry, click add new. I clicked the wrong button, add new, and go into uploads, okay, and then go to browse, and then just simply upload the zip file that you've download from, downloaded from us, which is right here. Click open it, and then click install. Okay, that's going to install successfully and then click activate plugin. Okay, and then it's active. And to check to see it's active, go to settings, find your WP Click Me setting here, click it, and that is going to take you to your WP Click Me panel here. And once you're in here, all you need to do to set up your first bar is go to add new or add bar call it something tester 2 or tester 1 is what I'm doing for this one um, then you want to type in your whoops make sure you can see this all on the page here so you can see it go live um, then you want to just type your message into the into the bar so whatever you want people to do if you're giving away an ebook um, if you've got a CPA offer or, or whatever you're putting on your, okay whatever you're doing just put that in there uh, put a link to your site um, make sure you use the HTTP so HTTP we'll go to we'll just send it to WP click me for now because I don't have an affiliate link ready for this but put that into the link URL okay then you can select one of our preset bars okay like any of these that we have here or you can just simply custom your own to fit whatever the look and style of your site is Okay, so you can select the text color you want, you can select the link color you want, the border color, okay, if you want to um, add a border to this, you can see that go on there, we'll make it pink, we'll make it ugly and stand out, okay, so you can see that border goes up, you can even change this link uh, box here and make it a different color, so if you wanted to have that bright white or gray, 
or whatever color you want to make it or bright yeah we'll make it pink okay that's ugly so that that stands out that's going to grab people's attention Okay, the other thing uh, that makes WP Click Me really cool is we've got these little icons that can draw attention to the bar. Okay, so you can put up a left icon. Okay, we've got uh, these that we created just for this. Um, and there's like a little devil face, happy face, guy smoking, arrows, siren, um, Michael Brown, which is uh, the palm tree because that's where I want to be right now is just laying underneath the sun out in the middle of the you know ocean or on the beach of an ocean but anyway uh, so those just grab attention as well um, and they fit on the bar like that so you if you don't have to use both sides if you don't want you only need one or the other or you don't even have to have an icon at all if you'd prefer not to have an icon um, in future upgrades of this we're going to get more icons created we're even going to have animated icons that show up on here that really get extra attention so those are coming up in future uh, upgrades of this so uh, let's go on here so what you want to do next is make it show somewhere on your site you can select if you want it site-wide if you want it on just the home page if you want it on an individual page or if you want it on a specific category now what's really cool with this well it, since you can select individual categories if you had um, various different um, categories on your site that weren't extremely relevant to each other like maybe they're similar but not exactly relevant you can create a separate bar for each category if you want so let's say you had a camera site that you were uh, reviewing cameras on okay nice expensive cameras you could put a link a a uh, WP click me bar at the top of every page or every category that um, is like your number one product for each of those offers okay so you can make more money because you're making a very relevant pop up a pop show right in front of them okay so this is gonna drop in and they might come to your your um, a certain um, category on your site and you're gonna show them exactly what you want them to see so if they're looking for you know long lens cameras or something like that you can simply advertise exactly that product right in their face okay and they can't miss it so you can make several of these you can a B split test as well if you want to make several um, uh, bars and make them different so you can see which ones are working the best okay yeah uh, now all you need to do is change your link te text which is this area right here we're gonna change that from link here to click here <clears throat> or whoops <clears throat> You can even do um, get it now, click here, get it free. Make it a nice little easy call to action, something that stands out for them. Set the status to active. If you don't want it to show uh, at a certain point, you can set it, set it to inactive or just delete it altogether. But right now, we're going to set it as active. You can make it open in a new or same window. Um, you can select your font style. Okay, I'm not going to bore you with that. You know what that means select your font style you can select different textures and in upcoming upgrades of this we're um, updates we're going to have more textures you can pick from here so just things that um, show up on the bar to make it stand out for instance you can put spots on it um, slashes that are little diagonal slashes it doesn't show up real well on the dark bars um, but you can see there it just adds a little texture if you want it on there okay for now we're just gonna leave it at none and again we're gonna have more of those in upcoming um, upcoming updates and we might even do uh, like seasonal bars like for Halloween uh, for Christmas and things like that where you can put little pumpkins and stuff on it just really neat little things like that that stand out okay you can select your bar position if you want it top or bottom we're gonna to select top for now and we simply want to save the bar Okay, once you save the bar, the bar, uh, you can see the status is active. It shows you your message for the bar. So if you had 15 bars going down here, you can see exactly what the bar is, what the name you gave it is, what the text is, all of that. And you can see if it's active or not. You can even delete the bar if you don't want to use that one. Um, and you can check the reporting on the bar. Okay. So anytime a unique visitor comes in, it is show here. And anytime someone clicks, you'll see it here, and it will give you a click-through rate. And you can select a custom date range, back seven days, or for today. Okay, you can check all of that. You can even go into an individual chart graph uh, for this 
by going to view report for that particular bar. And okay, we haven't done anything yet, so this doesn't show up yet, but you can see how that works right there. Now let's go take a look and see how the bar looks on the site. Okay, you can see that it just drops right into place and fits right at the top of the screen. Now, that's gonna grab someone's attention. <laughs> you see this pink bar drop in, it's gonna grab someone's attention. Now, just a little quick tip before I go here. Um, if you have a darker site, like a gray site, like kinda like this, make this bar bright, make it yellow, make it orange, make it bright red, um, something like that to get more attention to it. You want to um, put lighter, brighter bars on darker sites and darker uh, bars on your brighter sites, okay? Because it contrasts, it makes that contrast and that really grabs people's attention, okay? And the little icons help grab attention too. So do that when you get this. Just play with it, see what colors work and look the best on your site. So I hope you can see how this is gonna help you increase your sales, how it's gonna help you increase your click-throughs, and if you have advertisers on your site, it's gonna make them very happy if you're sending them clicks and getting them a good percentage of clicks. In all of our tests, we've incre increased our click-through on our money links greatly. We've increased sales. Um, we have a lot of good stuff that we've been able to do with this, and I know you're gonna love this bar, and I know you're gonna love getting future updates. So, you know, this is a WSO, um, and as we grow this, we're gonna keep adding new features and new updates, and if you have suggestions, we'll take those as well and put those in, uh, keep those in mind for future upgrades as well. And as a WSO, you get access to all the updates for life. So. Thanks again. I'm Michael Brown. Hope you enjoyed the presentation of WP Click Me, and I really hope you buy this product. I'll see you soon.